Hello. Bipolar crash, um, bipolar scrapbooking hide or doodle fingers 101. That's me. First, I'm going to tell you because I know that you're going to be looking at this and it might annoy you immensely. This happened last week when I was playing hot potato with my boys and they were throwing it so hard that when I tried to catch it, it was going towards my face. It, we were, th I, I hate to say it, but it's the truth. We were throwing around a stuffed bunny rabbit. Okay. It, we were just throwing around. We weren't abusing him. <laughs> and it was a stuffed animal. And uh, we were throwing it, and he, uh, one of my sons were throwing it too hard towards my face. And when I was trying to catch it, I actually scratched my nose with my thumb, my thumbnail. So I apologize if that's the one thing that's probably going to distract you. Hopefully not. In my first part of the video, I continuously said gorgeous the gorgeous uh, collection of Santoro. I am 100% completely wrong. It is from the Santoro, but it's called Trimcraft. Okay? So you would have to Google Santoro Trimcraft or just Trimcraft and one of the girls is called Maribel. Okay. So again, I apologize greatly if I misled people into Googling the gorgeous girls on the Santoro collection, Santoro collection. And now I'm going to show you the gorgeous collection from Santoro. Okay, and these are stamps. Um, I, I really love everything that uh, I've seen on Santoro. You can tell I haven't opened this one, but I'm going to do it now. And you know, I have to use up my stuff, not just, you know what, let me just show you. Here is. These are stamps. Isn't that beautiful? I'm going to tell you the name. Urban Rubber Stamps. Okay. Gorgeous. G-O-R-J-U-S-S. -S. Okay. And this one's called Urban Rubber Stamps. That is what this one is called. Okay. These are the things it has on there. Okay. I will show you what you would have to look for if you want to Google it. All right, so that's one of them. Simply gorgeous. I don't know if you can see that. She is called Ruby. Wow, this glare is really bad, isn't it? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. It's the glare. This is driving me nuts. Where are my scissors when you're looking for them? There it is. I apologize. I found the scissors. And now I'm going to take these out. I should have had it out a long time ago, and I apologize. I just I do a lot of things spur of the moment. I 
really don't want to take it out of the, this thing. Does it still have a glare? See, it didn't really make much of a difference. But this is Ruby. Okay. The other one I showed you, Ruby does have a name. The one that I had showed you, her name. No. Oh, it's called On Top of the World. This one's called On Top of the World. The other one's called Ruby. Here's the other one. Trying to figure out how not to give you all this glare, but I can't seem to figure it out, and I'm so embarrassed that I am so lazy that I don't bother to figure that out. And you're probably like seriously annoyed. Oh boy, is that better? I'm gonna guess that's better. She's called, this one's called the Black Star, okay? That one's called the Black Star. See, and if you want to know where the words are, it's right here. If you can see that, I will read it out to you. This one is New Heights. I've already used this one, as you can see. There's some stamps on there. Okay. This one is called... She's called Told Stools. This is what's on the stamp. These are rubber stamps. These work. I, I can't tell you how beautiful it is. Okay? And again, this one's called Toad Stools. This one is by far my favorite. And the name is down here again. This one's called The Runaway. I think I'm actually bleeding. I just took the scab off. No, it's not bleeding. I put coconut oil to try and make it heal quicker. And it does work. All the stamps come like this. So when you use your clear, clear blocks, you can see exactly where you're stamping. Okay, this one is called The Collector. This one is called Ladybird. This one's gorgeous, my God. This one is called you brought me love. Oh, by the way, it says here for gorgeous project ideas, visit docrafts.com. And I'm going to show you exactly where it says it right here. Going into my 11 minutes. 
Okay, I'm only going to show you the stamps this time, and then I'm going to show you the toppers. Um, number three, and part three. Yes, I bought a lot. Because honestly, every single time I get into wanting, getting into some kind of uh, mood, when I end up buying it, a lot of the collection is gone. So I just buy it all since it's something I know I love immensely. Okay, the Little Red. She's called the Little Red. She's absolutely gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I can't tell you when I got this. I was like a kid in a candy shop. Or a woman in a jewelry shop. But for me, it's a girl in a, in a, a scrapbooking world to be able to buy, get anything I want for free. <laughs> the stamps are on there. Like steampunkish, huh? This one's called the White Rabbit. This is my last one. Isn't she gorgeous? Oh, jeez. These are all the stamps that comes with it. These are all separate stamps. All separate. All these. They're all separate. But except for this one's a, a complete stamp. Isn't that gorgeous? can't help but keep saying it this one's called the fox okay again let me show you that stamp is complete right here okay and every other one is individuals how much did it cost me <sighs> I went to a lot of different ones and I wish I was better prepared for you as far as to tell you how much it cost me some of these cost me $9. Some of these cost me a little bit more. I did not get any of these on eBay. I sort of have issues with trying to trust. So I go with Amazon. And uh, I found it in Amazon. Plus I, get po I have points in Amazon. So uh, part three, I'm going to show you all the toppers. Okay, and some that I made. Love, love. Have a great day. Sorry this may have bothered you. <laughs> and my apologies again. The other collection I showed you yesterday as far as the paper pads. Those were called Santoro. And it's by Trimcraft. Trimcraft. Okay? Love, love. Bye.